The Google Play Games app is currently on beta testing on PC. Welcome back, Saviors GH here. We can now install the Google Play Games app on PC. Yes, we can now play some mobile games on PC natively without installing an emulator. And guys, the beta testing is region locked and is only available in some regions. And fortunately, I have access to the testing. And I can share to you guys my experience trying out some games available on the Google Play Games app for PC. And with that said, let's do this. And yes, you heard me right, guys. Only some games are available. Not all the games on the Google Play Store are on the PC client. It's because they're making sure it would actually run properly. And it would use proper keyboard and mouse controls, which I will demonstrate to you in a minute. And according to Google's website, it's actually one of the main features they're working on this PC application. It's to make sure all the games available on the PC Google Play playable with keyboard and mouse controls. And here are the available games, guys. It's about 60 games for now. They keep adding new games here every now and then. And if I'm correct, the games available right now is about 60. As you can see, there it goes, Mobile Legends. We're gonna check that out in a bit. And what else? I've seen Genshin Impact. Oh, look at this, guys. Sword Art Online, Integral Factor. We're also going to check this one out. I saw Genshin Impact. Oh, there it goes. Honkai Impact 3 and Genshin Impact. Man, we don't need to check out Genshin Impact because there's a PC Genshin Impact. Okay, so how about let's check out an MMORPG, uh, Sword Art Online, Integral Factor. And as you see, guys, it's completely ported to PC with WASD controls. And if you played the mobile Sword Art Online, you know that the UI is different. It's a lot smaller and as you can see the instructions indicated are for keyboard and mouse and after a few minutes of playing sword art online integral factor i can say to you that this feels like pc already now let's move on to a moba the only available moba is mobile legends and as you see here it's the tutorial part and we can move with wasd and attack by clicking the skill icons and i must say it's not ideal because there is no options to use the keyboard for the skills they should have some kind of a settings over here that allows us to configure the skills for the keyboard. Well, they do, but we can't change it. It's predefined. And oh man, it's very essential that we can change the controls. Because if you played a MOBA using an emulator, for the most part, the mouse is for buying items, navigating the UI, and aiming skills. And what we usually do is activate the skills with the keyboard and aim with the mouse. And we can't do that properly here if they don't allow us to edit the controls. This should be an easy fix. Just allow us to configure the controls and aim with the mouse. Okay, next game is 1945. It's a shmup. I play shooter games every now and then, but I can't do it on my phones because the controls is atrocious. No thanks. But in here, we can control using the mouse. And it's very easy to control. My only gripe with this game is how about accommodate the whole screen? I kind of don't like this portrait mode on my widescreen. Okay, anyway, next game, Cookie Run. I must say, the game doesn't really need that much of a control aside activating the skills. So I say it's perfect. Now, let's talk about the minimum requirements. Here they are. It's super low spec. Unless you're using an obsolete PC, you should be good to go. The only thing that you should be mindful here is activating hardware virtualization. And you can do that on the UEFI or BIOS. And this is Gaming Argo. See you in the next one.